Hello dear students, I'm Tammy and welcome back to my channel. Today I will teach you the grammar part, future, past, and present tense. So let's get started. So in Romanian language, we have like in English, past, present, future tense, and we will translate them as past, trecut, present, present, and future, viitor. Okay, in Romanian language, we have four types of tenses in the past tense and three tenses in the future. So today I'll teach you the one that we are using it day by day. So in the future, there is on my table, future and let's see, on my turn. Yeah. Uh, okay. So, we'll put it in our past. Perfect. Then we have present. Or, then we'll have Vitor 1. Vitor 1. All right. Yeah, board and perfect. So here we'll make, if you still remember the pronouns in Romanian language, we'll just type them. So first of all, we'll have where, who, yell, ya, noi, voi, dumia voastra, ye, yeah. I'll repeat them once again and start in case you forget them, so you, tu, el, ya, noi, voi, yei, ele. Now do not forget the first three, they are for the singular, and the last three are for the plural, meaning first person singular, second singular, third, he, she, we, First plural, then you plural, and you formal. Ye yele in English language we don't have, unfortunately, we have only they, no matter if it's for women, no matter if they're for men. However, here we have a difference. Ye is for a male and yele is for a female. All right, then I will go drawing and Make it a beautiful charm inside. And here we'll have something called auxiliar. Auxiliar and we'll have also this and have a, I, a, um, at, uh, didn't change my keyboard, change it right now, at, okay. As I explained yesterday in the live videos, um, if you know the auxiliaries in the past tense very well, perfect or composed in Romanian language, it will be an um, equivalence for the perfect, uh, present perfect in English language. I have had, um, and that's all. And if you know, so good the auxiliar, you don't need so much to use the pronouns at all. That's what I mean. Am mâncat, I have eaten. Let's say the verb uh, avi. Am avut. So the verb a avia in the to be infinitive, to have, sorry, to have infinitive, and the form infinitive, the past would be out. Usually the perfect compose in the past tense and with T or S, most of them. Then in the present, I want just to copy this and we'll make it in the present, perfect. Then we will start conjugating. 
Eu am, tu, I. Can you tell me for the third person? And no, it's not a, it's I. I. Then noi avem, voi avets, ye, yele, au. How you can see a slightly different because here we have ve, we don't have, and here also ve, we don't have. And, but it's not so complicated to learn. And let's see for the future. I shouldn't copy this one again because I have it already. And this and this. Okay. Then we will make again. And here we'll have the future. Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. To be. Yeah, yeah. Va. No, you Voi do me a while. Vets. Yeah, yeah. Vor. Let's see. Mm, and the other color. I think it's better. Perfect. Now, if this is past tense, the future tense will be, will be the same. Oh, yeah. Okay. You don't need to know the conjugation. You need to know only the particle. This particles. In order to know the tense. So, um, I, ah, uh, um, Arts how fast and I say what's the word um cut will be in the past when cut when cut yeah um when cut chocolate have it in chocolate. Now let's say in the future. I will eat chocolate. Yeah, boy, Minka. Chocolate. I will eat chocolate. Let's take another verb. Um, let's see. Drink. Yeah, we drink. Yell a boat of here. You have drunk chocolate. Coffee, sorry. You have drunk coffee. And then yell va via. Yeah. Yeah. Here we'll drink coffee. I hope you enjoy my YouTube channel and this video and I hope it's useful for you. Please, if you have more details and you would like to make more videos and have maybe different subjects that you would like me to talk, just mail me, follow me, subscribe and hit the notification button so you will be updating with all my videos. See you soon. Bye-bye.